Today uh, we're going to be reviewing uh, this thing called the Wonder Roller. Um, honestly, I just found it right now at a 99 cent store. It was actually $1.99 as you can see right there at the top. Now I was actually looking for a regular paint roller, but being the fact that there is nothing uh, nearby, um, unless you have to drive a Home Depot or something. So I figured, you know what, let's just give it a shot, see what it does. Honestly, I'm very skeptical whenever you pay $1.99 for something, it's probably not going to be good. And I, I don't have any high hopes on this thing whatsoever. Uh, but I just open it up, so I'll show you what's inside and we'll see if we can do something with it. But honestly, my expectations are super low right now. Okay, so I just opened it up right now and I pulled out all the contents on there. Uh, so it has this little thing right here, which is actually for the edges, uh, whenever you need to paint them. Uh, it looks like it's already falling off, but it's probably gonna work, do what it needs to do. Uh, it has the little tray, the little resting tray, which I think that's actually kind of cool. Uh, the cap, and then here on the inside, you can actually see uh, more or less where the paint is going to be flowing so that way it comes outside and you can use it it also has a hole for the extension which that's kind of cool and it has a measuring cup so i believe this is the probably the most you can put on there uh but it's actually not bad for a dollar 99 all right you know I'm, I'm i'm honestly starting to change my perspective on this uh but we'll see right now i'm gonna put it to okay the so i'm trying to do this as basic as i can i'm not trying to go fancy or professional or anything i'm just trying to make it you know as anybody would do at home super simple just put a piece of cardboard underneath it just taped up what we need to taped up that's it simple nothing nothing out of the ordinary i got the remaining paint right here that i'm gonna use I got the little measuring cup and I'm gonna go ahead and just try this on the roller. I put it in a small extension. As you can see, this is actually extension from a broom. I'm not going anything, you know, out of the ordinary. This is super basic stuff that you can find at home. So making it super, super simple for you. So I'm gonna go ahead and put the measuring cup on there. Uh, get some paint on it and I'm gonna try it out, okay? Okay, so I got the measuring cup full of paint. So I'm gonna go ahead and start pouring it in there. Okay, looks like that's about it. Might be a little bit messy, but we're not too concerned about that. We're just gonna leave it as simple as we can. Okay, so now I'm gonna go ahead and close this real quick. So uh, let's see if we can get it right. Just to remind you, I only put one cup in here just cause I wanna try it out. Uh, so, I mean, to the looks of it, I don't see any paint yet. I don't know if it's going to start coming out as soon as we start moving it, uh, but I'll put it on the little tray and I'm going to go ahead and start prepping here so I can start painting and see if it really does work. Okay, so I got the first section of the wall. I got the paint roller here and uh, I'm going to go ahead and try to see if it does anything. Uh, nothing yet. Still nothing. Okay, so I went ahead and added three more of those cups. So I'm hoping that I'm gonna see some paint start coming up. I mean, there's very, very, very little that you see shining through right now. I mean, there's very little that you see that's coming through, but it's still don't see much. Honestly, the paint that you see here, it's actually paint that it dripped when I was filling it up. So that's still not even coming out. I don't know how long it's gonna take before the paint start come out. You can see a little bit there, but I still don't see any. Oh, well, the cap's off. Well, I guess we'll see what else happens, but I'll oh, keep going with it and see. I'll keep trying it. Well, on a side note, the little edging painter, it's actually been working a little bit better than the other things. So I can't really complain. I guess for a dollar ninety-nine, I guess at least you do get a, a edge painter. That's not too bad. I mean, it's painting a little thick, but I guess it could be worse, right? But anyways, I'm still disappointed on the roller. The roller is not cooperating, but this is working. So we'll see right now. I'll give it another shot. Okay, so quick update. Um, did I manage to get something painted? Yes, I did. I managed to paint my shirt, my hand, and now my phone because I'm holding it. Did this thing work? No, absolutely not. The paint started coming off from this side and this cap, somehow it keeps coming off and then paint started squir squirting everywhere. Uh, so it made a mess on the floor. I mean, a good thing is that I put the cardboard on there. Uh, did it paint the wall? No, 
that line that you see right there is actually because I primered it. So that way, you know, maybe it will work if I did that, but no, it did not work. Is it worth $1.99? Absolutely not. Don't waste your money. I mean, unless you want like the little corner thing, uh, the little edge painter worked out pretty good, but is it worth $1.99? No, it's not. Uh, would I recommend it? No, I would not. I mean, if you have patience like me that it's been 30 minutes and I've been drying this thing, uh, then, you know, maybe you should give it a shot, but I think the paint that I'm using is too thick, to be honest with you. Uh, and it's just not not coming out so i'll blame it on that but other than that i would not buy it i mean at least in my personal opinion it seems like a great idea but maybe unless you're using different type of paint but as far as the paint that i'm using it's not definitely not gonna work for me so if you're doing this at home and you see this thing and you're like oh man that seems like a good idea it is a good idea um, i would give it a shot with maybe a thinner paint than the one i'm using uh, but this one actually works really good on the regular roller uh, like i said i just wanted to give it a shot see what it is i mean a dollar 99 doesn't cost anything really um but yeah it definitely did not work i mean i wasted 30 minutes of my life but you know i wouldn't recommend it but who knows maybe with different paint you know we'll, we'll give it a benefit of the doubt because this is a really really good idea uh, other than that, well, that's all I got for right now. Uh, if I find anything, I don't know what you guys think. Maybe I did something wrong. I don't know. But, you know, I'm open for ideas. So as far as right now, you know, I thank you guys for watching. And uh, I guess I'll see you guys whenever I find something else that's cheaper than this or better.